Hey everybody, two boys, one brain cell, Charles Beeson, Joel Norton, and uh, today we got something completely different coming at us. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, I've never heard of these guys, or person, uh, it's AJJ, um, this was a request, and it's People to the Reckoning. A and the album cuts off there, but it's People Who Can Eat People are, I'm hoping that's the problem. Doesn't look like it's gonna pop up for you either, bud. I can click on it. Here. Yeah, let, let's. I'm curious. Are the luckiest people in the wor world? Uh. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I have no clue. But it was a request by these wonderful people. So <laughs> All right. we're gonna check it out. <laughs> I'm. I'm he, curious. Yeah, don't don't let him lie. He likes the name. I he, do. He's like he's trying to play it off like. <laughs> I'm very important, and uh, no, this is no. It's absolutely this. disgusting. <laughs> but I mean, if they're that lucky, I'm in. Hulk <laughs> <laughs> punk, maybe. Not what I expected here. <laughs> I do love the instrumentals for this though. Yeah, they're yeah. Feels very bluegrassy. Yeah. Is that right? Ish, Folkish yeah. bluegrass type deal? I don't yeah, know. that kind of stuff. I mean I, I see what you're getting yeah. at. Yeah. Um, I definitely think this is folk punk though. Oh, but it's also just as fake from your daughter's birthday party to your grandmother's wake. You want to break that one down for me, bud? Let's, see, let's prove, prove to me you got the brain cell. Break it down for me. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know either. That's harsh. But a one, the big thing that I really like so far, your parasympathetic nervous system reacts. And the way they pick up the speed with the lyrics on that, oh. Mwah. Yeah, that is nice. I agree. It's a beautiful touch. That's a big-ass word to be thrown around. Yeah. So melodically. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And especially because the rest of it, you know, you're talking in your manic depression. It comes and it goes. Your parasympathetic nervous system reacts. That shouldn't fit, but it fit. Yeah, for sure. And I like how he got really high with the mode there. Yeah. On that fight or flight mode that we just heard. I had to look up the lyrics because I needed to know exactly <laughs> what he said there because I was impressed. Yeah. Like, I knew what he said, but I needed to have it ready. Yeah, hey, you're good, bud. You follow. Yeah, I follow. Um, they don't, but I do. Thanks, bud. I appreciate I, you. I got you. You know what? You could just give him the brain cell. I'm okay with it. Thanks, bud. You're welcome. Um, But, yeah, uh, honestly, the uh, vocals here are a little different. I mean... Yeah, they're not as rough as, like, yeah. days and days. 
Yeah. That we heard uh, call the corner, the last one. Yeah. This is more like uh, Pat the Bunny. Yeah. Yeah. I can see that. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Want to finish her up? Let's finish her up, bud. to sing so many times and I've tried to know which chord to play and I've tried to make it rhyme and I've tried to find the key that all good songs are in and I've tried to find the notes to make that great resounding din but there's a bad man in everyone no matter who we are there's a rapist and a Nazi living in our tiny hearts child pornographers and Someone in your head waiting to fucking strangle you. So here's to you, Mrs. Robinson. People of you more. Oh, never mind. Oh, never mind. In fucking fact, Mrs. Robinson. The world won't care whether you live or die. You live or die. In fucking fact, Mrs. Robinson. They probably hate to see your stupid face. Your stupid face. So here's to you, Mrs. Robinson. You live in an unforgiving place. excited about this one <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> first of all first of all i feel like they were insulting the song hey mrs robinson oh how yeah. fucking dare you guys <laughs> 100%. <laughs> that's a guilty pressure of mine i like that song <laughs> how fucking dare you guys um p.s there was there was uh there was two well-placed fucks there yes there two, was two of them so i'm gonna start with Ooh. instrumentally I did enjoy it. Yeah. Vocally, not a giant fan, but not super against it. Like, I'm not, like, yeah. days and days, I'm not a fan of their vocal styles. Right. But this, I, I can deal with this. Yeah. Lyrically, I do not know what the fuck was going on here. And there were some sketchy parts in there towards the end, and you guys know. There's um, a bad man in everyone, no matter who you are. There's a rapist and a Nazi living in our tiny hearts. Child pornographers and cannibals and politicians, too. There's someone in your head waiting to fucking strangle you. So I, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna say that I think what he's getting at is that everybody has the potential to be yeah. a piece of shit. I could see that. One thing that I found um, interesting is he threw, you know, child pornographers yeah. and cannibals and politicians. They're all together. <laughs> like, like what? <laughs> Are you saying they're all? Like, they're ho oh, oh. ho. I mean, I don't necessarily like politicians, but I don't know if I'd put them in that category. Yeah, no. Woo <laughs> um, speaking of uh, speaking of their uh, album name, uh, Cannibals, fitting. Yeah. <laughs> I just that popped in my head right then. Where? Interesting. Yeah, I am not. There's a lot there, a lot to unpack. Definitely, I think they're just mostly trying to be like, hey, we could all be shit. Yeah, I think that's what he's getting at. Um, uncomfortable though. Oh yeah, I think that's the best way you can put that 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 thing. So yeah. <laughs> um, what are you going rating wise and just like for everything in, mm. in general? I'm really confused on this one. You know, I think I, don't know. I think overall, I think I'm gonna go five seven five point seven here. Um. I'm on the fence. Like this is this is a difficult one. I'm really on the fence on whether I want it to go in the playlist or not. Yeah, because I think it's I think it's a decent tune. I like the music behind it. Um, I want to know more about the message. I know there's some super dark, 
you know, yeah, references that, here. And I mean that that kind of fits my I, brain. I get it, like what he's trying to break down. Uh, at the same time, that whole section makes me feel uncomfortable. Oh, absolutely. So that's gonna knock it down just a little bit for me. Yeah. But in overall, I, I enjoyed the the music, the voice. I was like, eh, you know, it, it's yeah. it's not bad, but I yeah. could warm up to that. I'm I'm positive of that. Yeah. I've warmed up to weirder. Um, I don't know if I'd say it was weird, but you know what I'm saying. Yeah. You get my my drift. Um, I'm gonna go. But yeah, you're right. That go, part is uncomfortable. It, that's a, that's the best way. It just makes me feel uncomfortable. Yeah. I, I feel like if it's worded differently, then I get it. Yeah, I get. We all have the potential to be pieces of shit. Yeah, he right? definitely he definitely said, "Hey, I'm gonna make this as far up as possible." Yeah, so it's it takes away the casual listening aspect for oh, me. Oh, 100. percent You can't. I no. wouldn't listen to that in front of your kids. Kind of thing. No, that, <laughs> for sure not. Which I enjoyed that the genre on when you Google <laughs> that was under children's songs. <laughs> Imagine mm. coming in your kids list. According, I like that. Uh, according to the Google search here in the about um, album, people who can eat people are the luckiest people in the world. Released 2007, genres, children's music, rock, folk. Thank you, Google. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm going to go 5.3 out of 10. Okay. Like I said, uh, I'd like to hear more from this guy, actually. Um, uh, I I could warm up yeah. to those vocals. I just like I said that there was parts of that song that made me uncomfortable. Uncomfortable is the best way to put it. Yeah, I get that. But 100%. I get I get the drift overall. Um, and I think warming up to it, I could enjoy the his uh, singing and all that good stuff. Yeah, so the, the number one thing that I want everybody to, uh, I hope everybody agrees with me on. This is not children's music. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. <laughs> good. Um. Anything else you want to add, bud? No, that's all I got for this one. All right, guys. This has been Two Boys, One Brain Cell, Charles Beast, and Joel Norton. And you guys have a wonderful night. Peace.